Finally tonight, prison inmates and returning soldiers and how some four-legged friends are helping both of them. The inmates at the Western Correctional Institution in Maryland have some new cellmates, dogs that they are training to become service animals for returning disabled veterans. The dogs are learning to operate light switches, carry items for their eventual owners and more. And their time inside works for everyone. The controlled environment makes their training easier. The inmates, turns out, are all former military themselves, so they know the importance of what they and the dogs will do. And they're not just helping today's returning veterans either. It brings a, uh, I think, a sense of normalcy uh, to the MA population. If you, if I noticed prior to coming up here, the dogs walking with a chow line, and there was a sense of calmness. Uh, inmates' hands in their pockets, staff mingling along with it, uh, and in this type of environment, that's incredible. I served in peacetime, so um, I, I kind of cringe when I, when I feel as though they don't get what they deserve when they come home. So this is a part of why I do what I do. Love this story. It helps everybody. It helps the, the returning soldiers. Is there nothing that dogs and cats cannot make better? Is there? Do we have pet owners at the table? I don't know about the cats part. <laughs> all, all I can tell you is anybody that's ever owned a dog or a cat knows that they give so much more to you than you do to them. I hope my kids aren't watching this. They have been bothering us for a pet for some You'll time. Never and we're we're, we're going to have to relent at some do point. It. Do uh, it. Maybe we should, not every dog is so wonderful. Not every. You know. <laughs> Whatever dog we they get are. will be wonderful. I'm sure. <laughs> really are man's best friend. They really are. They really are. And, you know, I'm mm. learning more and more cats are pretty good, too. That's uh, going to do it for us for this week and for tonight's edition. Thanks for joining us. We're going to see you right back here on Monday. Rich will be back in this spot. Have a great weekend, everybody. We'll see you Monday night at 6.